So I'm just sitting here and shit's coming out of there and I've got feelings of nausea, um, not feeling good at all, um, and, uh, animals are just all KO'd. Yeah, I feel really sick, um, Like, I'm sitting here, and it's a cool day, and I, of course I can't get the heater to go on, because she controls it, so, um, easily done through Wi-Fi, apparently. I have Wi-Fi in my house, so these things are so easy for the police, the feds, to figure out, because I don't pay for Wi-Fi, so I should have no Wi-Fi in my home, but yet, I know I do. Um... <coughs> Yuck. I was just listening to the audio on these little recordings. So, I guess that it was about at 9.20, if I remember correctly, I decided to, um, to set my alarm because I was falling asleep. And just, it's just so weird, that drug, it's just like, it just makes you want to go to sleep. It's just forcing you, you know? Um, because I wasn't tired. I had just drank a bunch of coffee and espressos, and, um, I was wide awake. But, uh, very soon after I laid down, I was knocked out. So, um, right now this is an actual video of a person being poisoned with isoflurane. Just a note. Um, I don't know how many videos there are of that, but that... Is going into my lungs. Um, yeah, and then the alarm goes off, and I turn it off, and then literally within a very short amount of time, they're in the room. And you can tell when they're putting something right on my face, and this is what I've been listening to on these audios for um, a very long time. Oh, me, he was looking at me like... Make this stop. I don't feel good. Yeah. I know. I know, sweetie. I know. Uh, Kitty was just like sneezing and stuff. They're just tired of it. It's tiring to constantly be drugged. So. Um, so there she goes and turns it off, even though that the temperature isn't even where it should be at for inside the house. But yeah, oh, <sighs> isoflurane, anesthetic. Yeah, I don't feel good, but I'm listening to the audio, and this will be on every single audio of me, is at a moment where I just start coughing and coughing and coughing and coughing. And that's when they're applying it straight to my face. And they're forcing it into my system where my body's, like, trying to say, no, no, you know. Because um, this is not a doctor's office and this is not an operating room. So um, they're using that. But, yeah, I, uh... Yeah. Um, yeah, I know, sweetie, I know, I'm sorry. Um, but on the audio, they're in the room, and I'm tired of listening to that. It doesn't get, um, old, the feeling of violation of having somebody in your room while you're asleep, or knocked unconscious with your pet. Um, it's just horrifying. And, um, yeah. They really got this whole Van Nuys apartment all twisted up. So, you know, anytime I go elsewhere, they're gonna, they're gonna do that. So, I'm gonna have to spend some time thinking about how I can deal with the Van Nuys police just kind of already designating this as their case, but then they don't really want to help me. 
Um, so, but they won't stop raping me. I know that because and torturing my body and doing things to me because they're getting away with it. <laughs> I mean, you know, you give a psychopath free reign, what do they do? Anything they want. So, but yeah, it's getting in my eyes. Um, it's making me sleepy. <gasps> and according to the audio, I fell asleep at like 9.30 <laughs> last night and didn't wake up until 8.00. So, um, but I did note that at that 12 p.m. note mark that I remember waking up, they were obviously, like, in the house, and I didn't get up, so, anyhow, just making note of how I feel, um, sitting in my own house, and the fact that I have to wear a big coat in here is because, it's because um, the temperature doesn't really get warm in here. The only time it's warm in here is when we leave the house and then they're in here and they want to have it warm. <laughs> so I come home and the house is all nice and warm and then when I get here, then all of a sudden the temperature just starts dropping and dropping and dropping. No matter what time of day. So there you go. Out. <laughs>